Hi, Pisces. This is just with your January 13th, 2020 weekly reading. I hope you guys are having an enjoyable day so far. Pisces, if you're interested, uh, the 2020 yearly tarot reading is up for review. You can click it, you can click the link to it in the description box um, if you're interested in seeing the yearly reading for Pisces. Also, after this reading, we're going to look at the Love Extended read. Um, so if you're interested in diving deeper into this love portion of the reading, uh, ooh, click the description box below because it tells you everything that we're going to focus on. We're going to also look into all the signs um, versus you as well. So if you're interested in that, Click the link in the description box below, either for the yearly or for the um, love extended read. Or if you want to set something up for yourself, all of that information will be in the description box below. Now, Pisces, uh, for you, you guys this week, you know, you're looking pretty strong. You're looking really good coming into 2020. Happy New Year's, by the way, for some of you or for all of you, actually. We're going to say some of you. Happy New Year's, Pisces. Uh, but you're looking really good coming in. Now, some of you may have two people in your household, right? It could be brother, father. It could be I get two males and a female. So I get three people kind of in a home situation. And some of you, you know, it all of you be different of what role you play. You could be the authoritarian and then there's a, a, a male, female here. Um, or you can have a, a dad that you're dealing with. But I do feel like everyone's kind of working in tandem. But there is someone who's running the show, right? Who rules the roost, if that makes any sense. And some of you, if you're having a business with your family, like a family business, Someone needs to kind of pull their weight um, in the family business. And I feel that if the three of you can come together effectively, right, you can really make a living. Like you can make something really um, work. You really have the opportunity to build something with someone. Someone out of the three has a great potential, great um, value, very creative, have a great opportunity to, um, help spearhead the business, if that makes any sense. So definitely opportunity to start business together as a unit, but it does first, some, all three, you have to know your positioning and play those positions, right? Because it's almost like two people are going to support the one, if that makes any sense. So there's that. Home life, though, though, does look really good, and I feel everyone is kind of comfortable in this home life dynamic, if that makes any sense. Now, some of you are kind of letting go of a situation that was burdensome to you. There is a missing, some of you could be missing someone or experiencing a loss. Um, it could be a father figure, it could be anyone, but you're experiencing a loss. And some of you, if that is the case, you're kind of finally letting that go. Um, releasing the burden, if that makes any sense. I do feel like you, you're coming in this week feeling very powerful, feeling very confident. There could be a new job, new opportunity. And if that is the case, there's nothing for you to worry about. Uh, I do feel like you are going to shine above many. You may be second guessing yourself because in the past things didn't work out and you may have become it. You may have felt like your money was low or that, you know, you had to dig yourself out of a situation, but that's then this is now. And there's great opportunities abound. And even in unlikely places, for some of you, you can find new opportunities now. But you just have to let go of those past hangups and thoughts of what could have been and what, what didn't happen and all of that stuff. You will just really start to feel very confident as the week progresses. And understand that your mind, and, and I wanted to say this, I don't know if I told you this in your yearly, but Pisces, oh my goodness. You have the opportunity to completely manifest something that you want and you're going to be so happy with the results. Um, and you just have to continue to keep the energy light. And I cannot tell you right now would be a great time for you to do mind. What is it called? <clears throat> mind, spirit, soul um, meditation, because you are going to literally bring something and materialize something into your life. And even just by speaking it. I mean, try it sometime this week as we get closer to the end of the week. You may say, you know, just think and say, I want chocolate. 
and watch someone's like, hey, I just bought you, I thought you wanted some chocolate. Or someone may just have it, like, come into a store and they're like, would you like a piece of chocolate? Like, it'll be that type of thing. Now, of course, you would want to use it on something a little bit more <laughs> um, valuable. But for try it because there is this um, heavy manifestation energy around you that you can use to kind of will at your disposal. There is an ending that has been or will be quite traumatic or dramatic, I want to say, um, that some of you are not still aren't over. And that will be your challenge this week. And like I said, you need to work your way out of that and work your way through it, or at least table it. Like, don't allow that to be affecting you right now. And don't, don't hide it by drinking and all of that stuff. Just put this energy to good use and that means to move forward in something tangible that you want or something that you want to better yourself with right <clears throat> excuse me this would be a great time to start a new regimen to um, look for something that you want new jobs start your new business this is like as we get closer to going into the next the end of this week going into next week great time to start something completely new and implement a new way of living a new lifestyle a new way of thinking and a new way of being or if you want to physically manifest something again law of attraction that sort of thing and start to make those steps and live in that reality because it is very possible now now uh, your reading is kind of straightforward. <laughs> it really is. You may have had, for some of you, there's a lot of, um, I feel like someone is trying to make amends. You may have that now that someone is really trying to make amends and trying to make things right. And it may be difficult for you to accept it. You or another person can vice versa here. Um, so those are two cards that just kind of came out. I don't know. I said, well, let me put these aside and just bring that up because um, there is someone trying to. I remember I said to you guys a few readings back blocked. So whoever you blocked, they're still trying and hope, hoping that this year will be a change and a difference that there can be. For some of you, happily ever after. For others of you, it can be just like, you know, now we're in a really great place, right? We've we've turned the page in this relationship. Um, couple Pisces. Uh, I feel like for some of you, hmm. Some of you may feel like your mate is dealing with someone at the office, like in the workplace, there may be another person that someone may be given to another and it could go vice versa. It doesn't have to be like, oh, you Pisces women, somebody's cheating. No, um, there may be two people that someone's considering. It could be, um, for some of you, um, I do feel like if that is the case, there's going to be a communicating, uh, communicating that and someone's going to get cut out. It's only going to be, it's only going to be one left. Um, if there was a problem in your relationship and it was a slowdown, right? And then you guys may have been on the verge of getting a divorce or separating. I feel like someone is ch changing that and turning that around and they're going to work their way to try to fix things. There's, I keep getting for some of you Pisces, there's another woman here it could be another woman that may have infiltrated a relationship of yours um like yeah that's kind of what i'm getting infiltrated a relationship of yours and it could be like a slow and it could be like she's a friend right she's a friend or she works with with your maid or she knows she's a part of the family it's something like that where it may be like she's removed in some kind of way but you may sense like, no, there's something going on here. So you may feel like there's something going on. And if that's the case, it's going to be really difficult for you to just forgive and forget. You may be trying to, um, but it will be difficult to forgive and forget. Someone could have got like you and your mate could have broken up and it's like, okay, one for the other, right? So someone's moving away from you and going to another person. Or someone's going to the other person and moving away from you or moving away from that person going to you. I just see like a changing of hands, especially if you're dealing with Leo. If you're dealing with Leo, Leo could have left you for someone or left someone for you. It's that type of thing. Um, so if that's the case, be careful with that. Because if someone is that easy to just drop someone and just move on to the next person without regard, they'll do it to you. So be careful with that. 
if you're in a relationship here. Otherwise, I feel like um, your relationship aspects to me is really showing up like more of an independent situation where the two of you are more independent. You have been spending a lot of time together. And as the week progresses, maybe there's like, okay, we have to go back to work or you have, I'm, I'm busy now, you're busy now, that sort of thing. But the two of you may be making plans to go on a trip, um, have some time together down the line, that sort of thing. You may even be trying to decide what do we do? Where do I go? Where do I take them? Their birthday or some type of special event could be coming up for you and your mate. And there's a want to take a long distance, long-term trip is what I see. Yeah, it's what I see here. And I feel like a lot of you are changing, especially if you're a Pisces woman, you're starting to really want to explore and get out and do things, especially if you have Aries in your chart, you may really be living on that Aries side of yourself and just really want to get out there and get going and do things and, and conquer and, and be kind of exploratory and, and just get out there. Um, someone probably wants more time and the other person it just it had, doesn't have that much time to offer has a lot going on is what it looks like too in your relationship cup single pisces you may have been i do see a lot of confusion there may be quote unquote options but i do feel like someone is trying to come back into your life this person is not honest um at all so and your haze, you, you you could have literally dreamt this person up. You could have like spoke their name and now here they appear. You know, it's like speak of the devil and, and here it appears. <laughs> so you could have drummed this person right up into your life or someone could have woke you up and drew you up. But, you know, it's almost like to get to a place of like love again. I'm not going to say it's impossible, but it may be close to impossible because this person is a manipulator and not very honest and could definitely be, you know, already in something and now they're scratching at your door. Um, so I will be careful. And also like you just have too much manifestation around you, Pisces. So be careful who you're thinking about because you will literally just bring them right into your cipher like really um you can bring this person you, you can call someone completely into your life yeah i feel like for some of you um well that's good you have your wits about yourself someone is definitely going to be you know kind of relentless trying to come back to you to some extent and i don't feel especially if you're a pisces woman i don't feel like you're going to accept that person in but there is a want to you know um, if you have children, there's going to be some, you know, discord around that. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> there's going to be some discord around that. Um, but I don't feel like you are going to allow this liar, cheater, thief back into your life. And that's good on you. Um, so kind of like Sagittarius, you know, I was kind of getting that energy too. So if you have Sagittarius in your chart, this would be even more of um, a more po poignant reading for you. Um if you're single. Now, if this is not about somebody coming back into your life, be very clear about what you're wanting right now because you have magic. You're very magical right now. You can create magic just by thinking, just by speaking. Please watch what you say. Please watch your intentions this week because, again, you are creating realities out of nothing um, without any candle and all this other stuff. Like, you're just manifesting it all on your own. Um and so if that's the case, it would be a great time to kind of focus on the things that you want to be your reality. Because I feel like you're getting very clear, though, um, Pisces singles. And I really feel like some of you are going to be going on a trip. That you're going to be manifesting a trip or making something happen um, in f as far as career and work life is concerned. Um, I do feel like people are going to be attracted to you. You will be getting attention, but you also will be attracting those people who are a little bit, you know, magical themselves so i would be conscious and careful with that which it looks like you will be so in this extended for love we're going to look deeper at this relationship as well as you singles and see what's coming up for you guys down the line week months to come and in the description box below you'll see all of what we focus on so if you're interested in that click that link and we can finish up this deeper part of the love portion. If you want something personal with me, click the link to my website and you can set something up for yourself. For those of you who like to share, please do so in the comment section below. And if you're new to this channel, welcome and subscribe because I will be back very soon with another one.
Take care, Pisces.